Okay, question for you. How many different versions of you are there? Most of us have quite a few versions of ourselves, and depending on the social context we find ourselves in, different versions get called up. And that's because identity is pluralistic. There's a concept known as dramaturgy. Dramaturgy is the sociological perspective that uses theater in a metaphorical way. And according to dramaturgy, life is a stage, we're all acting, and our audience is everyone we encounter. So this is the process through which we engage in impression management. And what's really interesting about this concept is that it groups our behaviors into two categories, front stage behavior and backstage behavior. Essentially, how we carry ourselves in front of people may not be how we carry ourselves in private, and that can lead to conflict. People can detect the misalignment between who we really are and who we present ourselves to be. So there are two things I want you to take away from this. One, we all conceal aspects of ourselves from others, and we finesse other aspects of ourselves that we want people to see in an effort to make a good impression. But some of us are bad actors, so we can come off as disingenuous and untrustworthy when we take the stage. Secondly, while we can be relaxed with no makeup on backstage, sometimes we're expected to follow a social script and act a certain way in front of people. So when we fail to play our part the way other people expect us to, we can be judged or criticized. But it's up to you to decide if other people's judgments actually matter to you. Ultimately, it comes down to balance. Remember not to lean so far into presenting yourself that you come off as pretending. But also, take people backstage occasionally. Let them see behind the curtain. They might just like the real you better.